Okay, we're getting out to a chilly start this morning, and it's been a cold weekend, of course. Yesterday, we had temperatures falling throughout the day, and today, we're going to be stuck into the mid to upper 20s. More 30s, more 20s on the way this week, but we'll finally make it above freezing by the time we get into Thursday and Friday. So that's going to be the overall trend as we go throughout the week. Looking at what you can expect for today, finally some sunshine around 8 o'clock will be mostly sunny. A couple more clouds started to push in later on this afternoon and evening. A high today of 26, but around lunchtime will be at 24 degrees. Here's a look at the temperatures across the upper Midwest. We've got 20s from Kansas City to St. Louis, but it's 9 in Des Moines. So we've got this pocket of colder, drier air, this cold dome of high pressure that has settled in across Minneapolis and Iowa this morning. That's what's going to keep us in the freezer over the next couple of days, but we won't make it below zero as far as our temperatures go. But wind chill values at times will be below zero. It's 10 currently in Waukesha and West Bend, still at 16 in Milwaukee and Port Washington and Racine. Kenosha is at 18, but it feels like 7 in Kenosha with the winds now out of the northwest at 12 miles per hour. One below in Madison and one degree. That's what it feels like in Watertown. Low pressure still started to pick up some steam across Nebraska this morning, bringing some light to moderate snowfall anywhere from Omaha as far south as Wichita this morning. It's going to be slowly pushing eastward over the next 24 hours, but for us, it's actually going to stay out of the area. All the snow will stay to our south. We could see a couple of flurries later on tonight or early Monday morning. So we've got a dry day for today. We'll start out breezy, then the winds will start to die down later on this afternoon and actually go calm during the overnight. A mostly cloudy sky for tonight, and there you see just a little bit of snow trying to make its way over that Wisconsin-Illinois border early tomorrow morning. That's when we could see a couple of flurries. Mostly sunny and cold for today, a high of 27. We're back down into the teens for tonight. It'll be mostly cloudy, so those clouds will be on the increase as we head towards the overnight. Just a few flurries possible late in the over overnight hours between about a two o'clock and six o'clock tomorrow morning 19. That's going to be our low. Let's check out your seven day forecast here. We've got some twenties for today. We'll make it up to 30 tomorrow. Inland areas will be stuck in the upper twenties. More teens for lows for a Tuesday morning. 26 and breezy, but mostly sunny on Tuesday. 24 after starting out at 10 degrees on Wednesday. We're finally above the freezing mark on Thursday and by Friday we'll be keeping a close eye on another disturbance, which could bring us some light snow for your Friday. But look at next weekend, Julia. It's actually looking pretty nice right before Christmas.